Hello everyone, this is a lesson on depreciation. Uh, the definition for depreciation is asset, they lose value over a period of time. So when they lose value, we say they depreciate. So in this video, we're going to look at an example of calculating depreciation, but using the straight line method. Then we'll do another video when I show you when we're using the other method. Okay. Let's start with our activity. Our activity says cost of equipment is 50,000. So the date of purchase in accounting, the dates are very important. Uh, you need to look at when it was purchased so that you know how many months do you calculate. So the date of purchase is 1 January 2017. And then the depreciation percentage is 10% per annum. So the question says, calculate depreciation for 2017, the year, 2018, the whole year, and 2019 using straight line method. So you're going to depreciate each year using straight line method. Okay, here, depreciation, when we're using a straight line method, we take the original value of the amount. Here, it's 50,000. The, the equipment was bought for 50,000. And then we multiply by the rate, the percentage of depreciation. So it's 10%. So 10% is 10 over 1,000. This is for the year 2017, the first year. So when we calculate that, you go 50,000 times 10 divided by 100. So for the first year, the equipment equipment will depreciate with five thousand. Now the straight line method is the easiest. For every year, you use the original amount and the same percentage. So for each year, you get the same value for every year until you you are done. This was the depreciation for the year twenty seventeen, because it started January and January we calculate for the whole year. This is 2018. So depreciation for 2018 is the same. It will be 50,000 multiplied by 10 divided by 100. And then you'll get the 5,000. Then it will be the same thing for the third year as well. For 2019. So the depreciation also for 2019 will be 5,000. Okay, let's look at an example where it doesn't take the whole year. Right, in this activity now, we change it a bit. The cost of equipment is still 50,000, but the date of purchase now is 1 September 2017. The depreciation is still 10% per annum, but the financial year ends 28 February, 2018 so how many months was this um equipment purchased was in our company was in the company september 1 september october november december january february it was six months so you not calculate for the whole year you calculate for the months that you had the equipment so it's six months the amount is still the same it's 50 50,000 multiplied by the rate is still 10% which is 10 over 100 now we multiply how many months it's 6 out of 12 I need to have 12 months in a year but we only had the equipment for 6 months so it's 6 out of 12 so we'll find the depreciation let's calculate right so um, 500 multiplied by 10 divided by 100 times 6 over 2, it's 2,500. So the equipment will depreciate with 2,500 if we are using the straight line method. This is the end of our lesson. Please watch the depreciation with the other method.